A newly formed Valley Robotics team just completed, uh, competed rather, in a national competition just last weekend, and they brought home some hardware. And as ABC 15's Jordan Bonke found out, their uplifting ability to work together as a team is loud and clear. This is what an award-winning robot looks like. Multiple engines programmed with a controller to move or pick up objects for points. These high school students competed against dozens of other robotics teams last weekend. They've been working together for just a few months, and among all teams across the country, they brought home third place. They were able to do so without ever speaking a single word. It was unexpected because we're rookies. Ducati is a robotics team leader with the Phoenix Day School for the Deaf. Indio is a builder alongside Phoenix, and on the controls is the driver, Anthony. Together, Team Vogue we're able to code the engines to tell the robot what to do, then in two minutes time, strategically move the robot to pick up discs and move them for points. Team Vogue built their robot in part to roll this bar for 10 points, in addition to moving discs for two points. Communication between them is their strong suit. There were no barriers in that competition. Communication went smoothly. And then after the match, we immediately met together in a huddle to get feedback, to figure out ways to fix and adjust. The skills learned to build and use this robot can transition to real life. Dave Huber is one of the coaches. What future do I have in robotics and coding? And my first thought was, you could work as a Tesla mechanic. You've learned all of the skills here that would be applicable to that job. This year's success has Team Vogue brainstorming on how they can throw a disc with a robot next year, even adding more teams to PDSD. With this robot, Team Vogue proves teamwork is much more than just talking. Anthony puts it best. We can be on par with the hearing world. We can compete with the hearing people. We've got the heart to play against them. We have everything we need. Jordan Bonke, ABC 15, Arizona.